I mean, the neighbors are gonna be jealous. <laughs> no. <laughs> They're staying. Those are all blue. Oh. I actually think I learned how to do it. Don't, don't, don't. A T connector. This project sucks. <laughs> we are legitimate tryhards. Hey guys. This looks like someone is trying to claw up the wall <laughs> with bloody fingernails. Hey, I'm Penn, and this is my wife, Kim. And this is her DIY wife, Monica. She's really important because she helps Kim with all those DIY craft projects that I super don't care about. And she's never more important than she is during the holidays. Joy to the crafts. <laughs> I, that was great. Okay, so what are you DIY wives up to today? I want one of those glorious, huge, gorgeous, big ornament wreaths. You guys have tried some wreaths in the past. That was yes. my face. So we, like this, I'm getting some PTSD here. <laughs> we have done so many wreaths. We've done like a Halloween wreath that fell apart. The July 4 wreath was okay. We're not good at doing wreaths. Um, we're not. But that is why I have a DIY. That's She's, where I come in. Yeah. I am not going to allow us to fail at this one. I mean, Christmas is my jam. I oh. am passionate about Christmas okay. and making a jumbo Christmas wreath. There's nothing more I want to spend my day doing. <laughs> Um, I'm super curious about this. So what does a jumbo wreath look like and where would it go? Like, okay, so this is not- very Christmassy. Right. We are gonna build the wreath around pool noodles. Now, Kim <laughs> ordered pool noodles. These don't look like pool noodles to me. Yeah. This box, box doesn't look so like small. noodles. Yes. Oh, you're just Why gonna did, this. Yeah, I mean, unless they're really compressed, this is what- Okay. Oh, and another box. It's like Christmas yeah, morning. It is. <laughs> it's not gonna work. I think yeah. Here, I just watch out. One, two. Come on! Oh, they are pool noodles. They are pool noodles. I was thinking they were gonna be tiny. I mean, this is ridiculous. So I think is our wreath. This is not really jumbo. No, no, no. We're gonna connect multiples. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's very jumbo. That's very jumbo. So that's a big wreath. Are you think? That's a little too big. I think we lose one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, like that. Okay. Okay. So we can take our family photo in here when we're done. <laughs> I have noticed just a really high volume of balls in this in this room. <laughs> Loads um, of balls. It, Loads of it, balls. Is that the, the main? It's just going to be situation? Christmas balls. A Christmas ball wreath. Just straight up balls in a circle. <laughs> okay. I don't see why that's funny. Okay. Why are you guys laughing? Let's call them order. Let's do that. Shall we? I don't see how like this. This, this, and this are going to actually work, so I can't wait to see how they actually work. So I'm gonna leave you guys with your noodles and your balls, and um, <laughs> I, happy holidays! Ho, ho, ho! Ho, ho, ho! <laughs> okay, what do we need? All right, for this project, you need two pool noodles. So here's the thing, if you're making this, it's probably around Christmas time. Likely you can't buy these in the store. We got ours on Amazon. Duct tape. We got some floral wire. I don't know yet if we're gonna need it. And then if we do need it, we have pliers to cut the wire with. Uh, what is that? It is a hot glue gun. I'm very afraid of it because I'm super bad at using it. Also, I think you're gonna need about one million glue sticks. So we have three bags. I even have three more. So these are really wonky. I think we should try and get them into a circle shape. Uh, oh, this method works a little bit. But then I think once now we attach them. There you hold that side. Okay. How do you feel about an oval wreath? <laughs> Let's tape these together. Yeah. So duct tape, maybe like a. Already struggling. So I'm gonna do the tape half on each, and I think it's gonna take a couple wraps. The ornaments are gonna add a lot of weight to it. Yeah. I don't know, with with a lot of balls and ornaments on this, it we need to adjust the shape, but I think it will look okay. Okay. Because here's the other thing that I did read a few different people have, that had done these. I think it's so smart to do like blog research beforehand. People said that you can just add more ornaments where you need to. So say this side comes in a little too much, we can fill it with extra ornaments. I 
think we just start. So what we're gonna do is actually just start hot gluing ornaments on this. Is there any secrets? Okay, I think we don't want our ornament hanger to be sticking out so much, so let's make kind of tuck those on the inside a little bit. The hot glue in the ornaments is not working. You gotta like let it cool. So when the glue goes on hot, I guess you gotta kind of hold it there a second. I feel like the glue might be melting the noodle. <laughs> oh, what'd you do? Did that See? just come off? Yeah. It's like highway oh. rubbery. <gasps> what? It is melting <gasps> oh, the ornament. It's melting the ornament. It is melting the ornament. So it's not melting any of mine. What exactly <laughs> did you do? <laughs> let me let me QC this. Now, obviously this wouldn't happen if we were using glass ornaments, but what would happen is they'd be shattered all over the floor. Thanks. Like it's not melting it for me. I don't understand. Uh, <laughs> I mean, the neighbors are gonna be jealous. <laughs> no. <laughs> the glue is working. I have like strings. Oh, a snowstorm, a snowstorm. They're staying. Those are all glued. <laughs> so this is why people on the internet sometimes lie because I don't think this is possible. Yeah, because here's the thing. When you heat up styrofoam, it melts. melts. When you heat up plastic, it, it melts. melts. I saw some price tags on those ball jars, like on my way out. I think this is gonna be like a $200 wreath. Jumbo wreath. 24 inch Crestwood spruce wreath, okay? So that's like two feet, that's pretty big. That's $38. I think we do it with the wire. With the wire, so just wire it up. Wire it up. Wire it up. So we're gonna try wire. Right. This is just floral wire, and we're stringing the ornaments on. This is also going to take forever. Yeah, and we'll string them, we'll attach them in little bundles on there. So I'm gonna wrap it around and then for wire like this, you just twist it on itself. I do feel like this wire now, I could just fill in some like, with a little hot glue now. I'm trying to get work done, but I can't stop thinking about the cost of this wreath. <laughs> um, so I just decided to look up some other things that I could buy for less for Christmas that I like much more. Uh, for $60, you can buy this sweater where Kim and I would both fit in the same sweater. That's a win-win, because I get to be close to my lovely wife. That's 60 bucks. Uh, for 40 bucks, this is a cardboard cutout of an excited Will Ferrell from Elf that I could put in my front yard. That's 40 bucks. For 20 bucks, I can get these socks, which if you look closely, shows Jesus dabbing. I would go to the dentist for this, and I haven't been to the dentist in seven years, no lie. What? Why? You have beautiful white teeth, but going to the dentist. We have a bigger issue that we need to talk about. The dentist thing? Yes, you have to go. I will go right now if you let me stop doing this. This super... Oh my god, there's ornaments everywhere. What else could we be doing right now? Um, literally watching paint dry. Oh, hi honey! Don't worry, you guys are doing awesome. You're gonna get it right. Even though you probably won't finish till tonight. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Fun <laughs> trying, you guys are super awesome. The wreath will be a hit. <laughs> written this far. Hey, it's Christmas time. You guys should all be smiling because it's crafting and fun. But it'll be two weeks until you get it done. So have yourself a merry little 
craftsman now. Do you feel better? I do. Yay! Oh we all feel better. Oh, oh, are you amazing. Oh. I actually think I learned how to do it while he was doing that. See? Honey. See Look. Uh, all right, four ornaments. I put them on the front. I twist. That's looking pretty good. Yeah. Then I take another ornament. Glue it. And I glue it. But I think that sort of worked. Yeah, look, look, look. <laughs> we are now onto a method which I think is our best bet yet. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I think okay, it looks like a circle. It looks more circular. There's definitely bald spots, okay? And yeah. we could continue to fill them. That's not a life decision I want to make. No, I feel like I've already spent enough time on this. This is like a boyfriend I need to break up with at this yeah. point. <laughs> that like I've spent a lot of time and energy into something that's not gonna change. <laughs> You're never gonna change, Kevin. <laughs> Okay, hold on. Is it gonna be a Christmas miracle? Okay. Sorry, got a little. It's a okay. Now Christmas turn this something. way. Right here, just put your body here for camera, and then look. Hold okay, up. ready? One, two, three. This way. <laughs> I mean, yay! I love it. It's great, guys. This project <laughs> sucks. <laughs> Guys, you tried so hard though. We, we are tired. It, you can see some yellow and you can see some purple. It's a little droopy. It's a little droopy. And oh. it, it, it will just keep falling off. It needs I mean, an augmentation. It, it, it needs, needs like, a little nip and tuck. Yeah. Yes. Um, oh, guys. From the road, I think. If you're driving very quickly, very run quickly. Here, let me look. Let me Do see. It. Run by. <laughs> How's it look? It's not that bad. <laughs> How is it now? Look at the wreath. That's not too bad. Oh, look at the road. <laughs> okay, we've got our three T's. We're starting with the time. How much time did this take? After an hour and a half, I stopped really paying attention. So I think it was about an hour and a half. Yeah, and it took like three years off my life. Yeah. So time and, and life expectancy is lower. Right. The, uh, the, the cost, the tab, I really. Tab. Mm -hmm. How um, much is the tab? Well, the buckets of ornaments were twenty dollars a piece. We bought. We bought nine, but we only used eight. We only used eight. So, so that is a hundred and sixty dollars in ornaments. Mm -hmm. How much were the pool things? Uh, those were like nine dollars. Uh, anything else? Hot glue. Hot glue. How Hot much were those? Ten, ten bucks, bucks in glue. Yeah, ten bucks okay. in glue. Okay. So this is a hundred and seventy-nine dollar wreath that you're looking at uh, over my head here. It looks like a million bucks. <laughs> we learned that the hot glue melts the ornaments. Yep. We learned that the hot glue actually melts the pool noodles. Yes. So Monica invented this four ornament, five ornament cluster twist oh, okay. thing and then wrapping. Okay. Yes. And then we learned that if we just did a single color pool noodle in a green or a red, it would be less glaring. That we have gaps. Like you yeah. can see purple and yellow. If mm -hmm. that was red or green, who cares? Yeah. Uh, we also learned that this is the type of project you should do if like you have nothing else to do in your life and you don't like the want to enjoy your life. <laughs> because if we stuck with this, we could fill in these gaps and make it look better, but we don't want to. We don't want to. The suspense is killing me. I don't me. have okay. enough thumbs for this. Thumbs up or thumbs down? One, two, three, go. What? I just what? feel like I should what? provide some holiday cheer. <laughs> and I drooled on myself when um, I said that. Yeah. Wow. So I appreciate I'm that. I'm just, you guys, you tried so hard. Like, honestly, I would put this up in my house because I'm the guy who doesn't care about what's it's up, up at your house. It is not literally up at your house right But now. we just spent $170 on a piece of crap. Um, so, I can't wait to see the pictures of everybody else's DIY ornament wreaths. Bye. Thanks for watching. Happy holidays. We the balls. No. No, they're all glued. Okay. Hey, don't forget to subscribe for more DIY wives and what other sort of crafts and DIYs should we tackle together? And don't forget, one more thing follow us over on Instagram.